might get in trouble. Um, uh, Anger Girls. Nice. Tidbit. Do I like birds like Dina does? I love all animals. A musical interlude, right? Come on. Come on, it would have been great. Fox. Hi, Londi. How are you? Nice to see you. Hi, Laura in Utah. Stelio in Pittsburgh. Um... Do you, do you expect the great progression of Dina and Amy's relationship when the show started? I love this question, Juliet. Um, I always thought that their relationship was really interesting because I think that Dina, if really asked, it's like Amy's probably her best friend, but it's someone that she to outside of work, you know? I feel like um, she tries to make it sound like it's like she's cool and she has all these friends and stuff, but I think at the end of the day, her coworkers probably are her only friends. I also think that um, even though Dina's by the book and doesn't really let Amy off the hook, she adores Amy when it comes like deep down to it. And she really does want the best for her. She's just misguided in her communication style and how she meant things. So I love the Amy and Dina friendship so much. So, so much. My cat's name is Sharky. Thank you. Show. Guys, tweet at Justin Spitzer. Tell him that you want it. We've been begging for it since season one. Uh, Becca in Arkansas. Hello. Can't wait to see it. When's do Dina's baby due? It's still, I think she's still got another three, four months-ish at this point in our timeline. Um, hi, Christian. Hi, Laura, it, that's just an H. I thought she was saying hi. How long does it take to write a script? Well, it depends. I mean, I, I many hours of many days. <laughs> do I get recognized a lot? Yes, I do. Uh, especially if I'm at like an airport or a Disneyland or, you know, somewhere like Vegas. I get recognized a lot there too. I've not directed any episodes yet, Katie. Uh, but who knows what happens down the road. What's the biggest challenge to acting? Um... I mean, for us, a lot of the time, it's not ruining takes with laughter because we laugh a lot. So, hilarious. He's doing amazing things, though. You guys got to like Google him and catch up with his career because he is super busy. Um, like Dina, I don't think I'm that much like Dina, but some, sometimes I feel like I am, you know? Are you going to get more backstory to Dina? I hope so. I would like that. I think Dina would do a natural labor. I do. I think that she feels like she's above drugs. You know? How much downtime do I have? <laughs> uh, none. Uh, what do I typically do if I have downtime? Sleep. Um, my boyfriend and I just went on vacation to Jamaica, uh, which was long over. It was glorious. Oh, somebody wants to know where I live. Ooh, that feels creepy and unnecessary. Uh, how long does it take to film an episode? Uh, will Dina and Garrett fool around again? You gotta watch. Um, Dina is crazy, Bobby. You're not wrong. Super store crossover. crossover. I think that'd be super cool. Uh, I have not gone into Walmart and acted like I worked there, but I do have to say that I do get recognized in Target a lot. What's my favorite episode so far? Tonight's, obviously. Oh, I'm so excited for you guys to see it. You're going to go crazy. Diner's still here. I feel like I may have seen something scroll by. It goes so fast, you guys, that sometimes I can't comment on all of it. But if they are here, Cloud Niners, guys, hi. We love you. We love you. Do I think that if Dina has the baby that she will want one of her own afterwards? Good question. You got to watch. It's not Glenn's real voice. It's a character choice. We do love each other. Um, Super Fun Night's been off the air for like four or five years, so I don't think that's going to happen. But Superstore is uh, pretty good. So how what is supposed to be the real life time between episodes? It varies, but if you pay attention, there are hints, there are different clues as to what's going on. 
in tonight's episode it references it being